Hey, look what's back. Let's go for a ride. You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today. First off, for those of you who don't remember this badass helmet that was supposed to come out, let me refresh your memory. This helmet had a 180 degree rear view camera with a heads up display, you know, a tiny screen just below your right eye where you can see entirely behind you. And the helmet synced with your phone via Bluetooth. You could receive GPS navigation directions on the screen as well as receive hands-free calling and streaming music from your phone. And the helmet was DOT ECE certified and had the perfect fit and looked badass all at the same time. And it got Everybody hyped up. By the way, this started with the Indiegogo crowdfunded project. And a lot of you guys sent your hard-earned money into this project because you were so hyped up about this badass helmet in hopes of receiving one of these helmets. But you know what? The company misused the funds. Uh, allegedly, they spent a lot of the money on expensive cars, extravagant vacations, uh, strippers, just living it up YOLO style off your money and then they shut it down by filing bankruptcy and you guys got nothing. And that's why I tell you guys why I don't send a dime to any one of those crowdfunded projects. People don't want to work no more. They want free money. They want to ask for handouts. It's e-begging, you know, and I can't stand it. It's a shame that you get, you know, people out here like this that, you know, rip people off but you know what i got really fantastic news for you the ceo of gas gas trail dirt bikes ivan Contreras, actually purchased the remnants of scully and revived it and they're going to be selling these helmets this summer and they've renamed it to the scully phoenix phoenix ar helmets and they said they're going to make good for on for those of you guys that pre-purchased this helmet on Indiegogo. They're going to send you a helmet, which is really awesome. I think that's fantastic of them to do. They didn't have to do it, but I think it's great that they, they did it. And also, like I said, they, they raised the price to $18.99, which is pretty steep. But I'll tell you guys that you really can't put a price on safety. If this helmet is all that it's supposed to be and you're able to see really good behind you like that. I know there's another helmet out there I think called Review or something like that that is similar. Um, that is awesome because I'll tell you guys, you know, keeping your eyes on the road and being able to see behind you, you know, looking out of your helmet is fantastic and could really help keep you from having a real effed up day so i think it's great like i said you know if you want to spend five thousand dollars on a helmet like I said do it if you have if you want to because you can't put a price on safety your safety is the most important thing however you know will i spend nineteen hundred dollars on this helmet um i'll wait and to see what you got when you guys give reviews on it after several months or maybe a year and you give the thumbs up on it then maybe i'll probably purchase one but, um, you know, I'm really skeptical about these, you know, new type of products that, that come out on the market because, uh, you know, I'd like to see reviews first on them. What do you got? What are your thoughts out there? Will you buy? Will you pay this money for this expensive helmet? Um, share your thoughts in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you guys. Um, in my opinion, I think you know, helmet manufacturers like Shoei, Arai, and all the rest of them need to step up their game and, and bring incorporate more technology in the helmets because right now helmets are still in the dark ages. They really haven't done much with helmets over the past years besides maybe add GPS to it and maybe other few things to it, but nothing major. So I think it's really awesome to see somebody that, you know, uh, make a helmet like this and if it pans out it will be awesome and change the game but anyways for those of you guys who want to get the gear that i rock you know the high vis helmet my camel pants my armor jacket my boots gloves everything my backpack no drag backpack I always include links in the description and comment section of my videos or you can go to my website at psychocruiser.com and click on the menu tab my gear and those are links to all of my gear and mods to my bikes as well if you want to see more of my videos click on the menu tab my videos on my website and those are a bunch of playlists with all my over thousand plus videos categorized into those playlists to make it easier for you to navigate through if you get a chance check out my other channel book out moto that showcases a van that i customized for cheap that allows me to live in my van with my motorcycle anywhere 
and has a ton of cool mods and that channel has everything from build videos trip videos uh, anything and everything bug out moto hey hit the thumbs up button if you like this video it really helps me get motivated to make more videos when you hit the thumbs up button as a courtesy I included two video playlists one for new riders and those are all of the videos I've done over the years that I feel are helpful for new riders and also my popular videos playlist hey hit the subscribe button I appreciate it take care